Well, Continuum is a great opportunity to uh, train people across Europe and in different uh, countries and in different uh, regions in Europe. Um, you know, we hope to take advantage of sort of uh, of uh, the best knowledge and expertise across Europe. So the people that are developing the Continuum program, you know, they're, they're based in, in several different countries in Europe. They're bringing these different perspectives and experiences. Um, but I think there's a lot of expertise that's gone into Continuum. And so really this should be a, a good program aimed at um, giving local training to people, you know, and sort of local teams and local individuals to just sort of, um, um, sort of raise the quality of care that's um, delivered to people with ADHD. My hopes for a Continuum um, initiative is that it's not one more initiative in which um, um, the theory is the most important part of it. Um, and I do believe that it has to be an initiative that is really pragmatic and focused on practical problems. The Continuum program is going to be really helpful for those who, who aim to, to have uh, more experience in ADHD. I was surprised when I heard the results that uh, clinicians considered um, quality of care in ADHD uh, about six, six out of ten. So, so I think uh, the quality of care uh, needs to improve. I think the best practice in treating ADHD is to really individualise the treatment for each patient because it's quite different, uh, the needs are quite different. So individualizing and treating with a good follow-up is uh, very important for the quality of life of these patients and for the families. Most clinicians are tired of going to meetings and listening to professors giving a 45-minute lecture on um, a mechanism of action of one drug or you know the last uh, piece of research. What they really want is to discuss clinical cases. You know, I have these cases from my own, from my own experience. I don't know what to do with them, and and I think that um, the approach that um, this continuum initiative is going to um, to, to provide and it's going to to give. Uh, is going to be radically different from what I have seen so far.